Welcome to Connie's Health and Fitness pre-show today. Today you will not see my legs because I had something nice to wear and I forgot my pants. Even though I heard from some of my friends that probably we would get more subscribers if you would see that I don't wear pants. Uh, I still want to stay here seriously because I have an MD here as my guest today and we don't want to embarrass him and maybe his wife. So you see just the upper part of my body today and upper part of Dr. Jason, Perry Jason. My topic today will be in the pre-show of my Connie's Health and Fitness show, football, crossfit, yoga and the orthopedist. And guess who the orthopedist is? It's Dr. Jason Perry. Welcome to my show today. Thank you for having me. And uh, we have one special question, like right before the uh, big game, the Super Bowl next, not, not this Sunday, it's a week from Sunday. Correct. It's about uh, football. What is your opinion about concussions? Now the new film came out, I think it was Will Smith about concussions. And uh, what do you think about concussions in the NFL? That's a good question. That's a loaded question. Uh, concussions, you know, from a medical standpoint, we recognize concussions a lot more than we used to, and I think we know a lot more about concussions than we used to. Um, I am a Division One college uh, physician. I take care oh, of FAU, okay. and so you know, we see and treat a lot of concussions throughout the entire year, and you know, we take them very seriously. It's a it's a real problem that we see uh, very often in contact sports. Um, and without proper treatment and good evaluation right. and knowing how to manage a concussion, right. um, these, you know, these injuries can cause a lot of problems with athletes. But could that be, now looking at the NFL and being billions of billions of dollars involved here, or uh, is that maybe a money-making thing from the footballer on the one side? On the other side, maybe it's overdone to, let's say, make more money about the, through the liability insurances? Or is that something what, you know what, if you decide you want to go into football, this is just a part of it, like you go into boxing, guess what? Concussions, that's your main thing, what you have to deal with, and they, people still do it. Is that something, how would, you, how would you take the risk, how would you think about that, personally? Well, that's a really good question. Um, you know, the NFL right now obviously has um, a lot to think about in terms of their, you know, former concussions and their athletes from years ago when you know, concussions were handled a lot differently right. back then. Uh, from a research standpoint and a medical standpoint, we might not have had the same information back then that we had now. And, um, you, know, I, you know, personally, I don't think that it's a, a money-making thing. Um, you know, obviously, I treat a lot of concussions, and it is a real thing, and, and it's a real problem that athletes deal with later on down the road. They may, you know, they may deal with problems from their prior concussions. Sure, sure. Um, but, you know, we don't know too much about that right now. There's a lot of research being done by... Uh, plenty of people around the world um, seeing if concussions do cause uh, problems later on in life right. and uh, you know the money aspect is something that you know us doctors don't like to get into um, but yeah a lot of sports definitely see concussions boxers see concussions footballers um, you know any sport in which there's right. going to be contact right. between two right. people um, you know, how to handle that is, I think, up to the individual. It's a risk that you know going into the sport. You are professional, that's, you know, you get paid millions, that's the risk what you have to take. You can work in the bank for like $15 an hour, and then guess what, there you will not get any concussions, and you are on the secure side, maybe not financially. Thank you very much. If you are interested you. in more, always Fridays, 1 p.m. live on Connie's Health and Fitness Show on WNN AM 1470 and the replay Sunday, 7 p.m. And you can tune in also on your iHeartRadio app nationwide. Good.